Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video I am baking. Ah, uh, for you that don't know me, I have I bake a lot, but I usually bake with someone and today's not one of those days, there's no one here. And you may have noticed that I'm in a different background. It's because um, I'm at my boyfriend's house, his parents are away for the week, uh, for his mum's birthday. Don't ask where they've gone, I don't actually know. Some weird name, I can't pronounce it. But I am basically here because nothing to do. And it's kind of easy to film a video when no one's in the house. So my boyfriend's at work, it's all this what I'm doing. But I'm sorry for the long intro, let's get on with the video. This is what we are making today. It is a simple school sponge cake with white icing and multicolored sprinkles. So first you need margarine butter. I have stock. I'm sorry you can't see my face, but apparently my camera is just doesn't want to work today. It just wants to, so it's the only way I can show you is by doing this. So this is on scale, you just can't see, because like I said, the camera's being weird. So I need 200 grams of butter, or margarine. You can use butter, but my mum always told me it gives a weird taste in cakes if you use butter. So, I choose not to. they made this in school. This and custard used to be my favourite thing to eat. Yeah, 201. Thank you. Oh. I would recommend buying more stock because all that stock is gone. About some calf sugar I had to change because it's getting out of the moon. For calf sugar, you need 175 grams or six ounces. Yeah, yeah, six ounces. So I'm using oh, this glass of sugar. Silver spoon. And people may say it's a lot of sugar, but You've got to understand you're making a big cake because this was literally for a school and I can't be asked to cut it down because <laughs> there is a lot of people who eat this so see my thing is I can't have it like, um, what do you call it? I can't. I'm very sorry about the light. I literally had to move because there was no plug socket near me. This is a bit better, but the light is terrible. It's natural light, so I don't get why it's so terrible, to be honest. Thank you. So it says mix the sugar and the butter together. First, oh, not if it was on. So you get a sort of like that three eggs. I usually crack, let me put this aside. I usually crack my eggs in something else just in case they've gone off. And if these have gone off, I'm really, really like stuffed to be honest, because 
can't really get us to go to the shop. But that cracked weird. Doesn't have a use by date on it, which is very silly. Eggs might, nope. It's very powdery. I was little I used to you know be scared that if I cracked an egg then like, chicks would pop out I put um, my boyfriend's oven is electric so I put it on 160 at home I have gas which is gas mark 3 you should not put this too high because it's a very delicate cake most cakes are delicate but so Yes, I will put actually all the ingredients down below and just, yeah. Right, now I need flour. I was going to add my eggs, but I thought I'd do this together. How much flour do I need? 200. 200. And you came and you went when I take it. Balls. I'm sorry for saying balls, people. But. It's going to be so much washing up. It's one thing I hate about cooking is I have to wash up. Luckily, my boyfriend's parents had a dishwasher. Yeah, I was right, this one. But I'm kind of not that type of person. Unfortunately. And then just mix them all together. Just gonna scoop all the mix off the mixers. Taste it. Tastes good. My family have a thing of loving cake mix. So, so I'm just gonna get all the extra. I didn't get mix. And then, so right, my hands are clean and I'm not using the one that I just licked with. Now I am. But, ah, shush. I just, I just went everywhere. Yes, yeah, so now. I'm gonna clean these off and then this school cake is always rectangular you can make it like circle but I've been told it cooks better in a rectangular I don't actually know why I don't actually ask I just got told it cooks better my boyfriend was supposed to make this but obviously with him being at work and stuff like that it doesn't really help stuff so I have this so it may be too big but it's in the box oh. 
dishwasher. Then you just pour it in. lump so yeah most of it is on my hands but it's cool end result sorry about all the marks um i had to test it with a knife to see if it came out clean and yeah this is the end result mm, love it so when it's cooled down i'm gonna put some icing on it and sprinkles and you'll see that soon hey guys i hope you liked the video of the back to school simple school sponge cake ah that was so much words um, we demolished it and it was awesome but I think you should go oh my god why can't I talk today <sighs> why don't you go check out some of my vlogs that are on my channel because I personally love them I personally like to see like for you all to see what I do on a day to day basis and I'm vlogging a lot more because I've got a lot more stuff coming up in the next eight months to be honest between now and um, between now um, wherever it is in eight month time I have a lot of stuff going on and I will take you with me so don't forget to hit that huge subscribe button or click my lovely face which will be about here don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and comment down below if you've ever had this in school bye um.